he don't deserve none of this. <laughs> none of it. <laughs> a grandmother and her family in turmoil days after her 25-year-old grandson, Keontae Johnson, goes missing while being discharged from a Chicago area hospital following a week-long mental health evaluation. They just released him out there. They know that he went in his right mind. They know he never been in this area and he don't know how to get home. The family says their nightmare began last week after they told Keontae, who has special needs and was later diagnosed as a schizophrenic, they were moving from the South Suburban home he once shared with a close cousin who recently died. He didn't want to um, leave that house um, where, where he was at because um, it had a lot of memories. His cousin was there. Police responded and took Keontae to a local hospital, which transferred him to St. Anthony's Hospital, where he was admitted for a mental evaluation. Relatives say he was there for a week. And when they arrived to pick him up on July 12th, the unthinkable happened. They learned he had already been released. They say it was another Johnson, so they let both of the Johnsons go. Officials with the hospital did not respond to our request for comment. The family began searching for him and filed a missing persons report with Chicago police. They also filed a report with Cicero police after Keontae was spotted and picked up by officers. He did not appear to be in distress and was released before officers learned he was listed as involuntarily missing from the hospital. Keontae Johnson was last seen wearing a white shirt, black pants, white socks and black Nike sandals. Meanwhile, as his family continues to search for him, they pray. Just let him come home safe. Evelyn Holmes, ABC7 Eyewitness News.